So what makes an insurance company ultimately pay a claim? Hey everybody, this is Grant Moraine with Moraine and Buckaloo. And let me first tell you, it is unusual when insurance companies are reasonable on their own. It does happen, but it's pretty unusual. So what do we do at the firm to get them to pay a fair resolution on a case? Well, one good thing that we do to push them forward is get it ready for trial. Let me tell you a story. We have a case that we have just resolved a couple days ago, and it was a case where there was one level of insurance that had already been paid, and we were fighting with the next level of insurance, the UM insurance. We went to mediation, we made a demand, and they offered a pittance. They said, what will it take to settle today? We told them our number. They waited two weeks, but we were ready for trial. We filed all the necessary documents. We showed them that we were ready for trial. We sent them a document that required their input as well, and we kept writing to them and saying, we've had given you our portion. Where's your portion? We wrote again. We called again. Finally, on the day that it was due, they called and said, we really want to settle this case. What's it going to take? And we told them the exact same number that we'd told them weeks before. At about 4.45 that afternoon, with the document due at about 5.30, they called us and offered us exactly what we had asked for before. It was eight 18 times their initial offer and what they told us they would pay to settle. So it was just by demonstrating to the insurance company we were ready to go to trial, we got them to pay fair compensation. That's how we try to work cases up here at Moraine and Buckaloo. If you need some help, give us a buzz. Thanks very much.